Hi, good morning. This is uh, DU7JY and this morning I am going to show you how I tune my off-center fed dipole using my uh, MFJ949E antenna tuner and a nano VNA without using uh, my radio but instead attaching it to my nano VNA. Now the off-center fed dipole is a um, is a, uh, a multiband antenna as you can see here on the on the plot um, now the span is from 7 uh, megahertz to 30 and you can see these dips here there's three dips here uh, one is somewhere in the 7 somewhere in 14 and this one is somewhere in the 28 uh, megahertz so those are the frequencies that this antenna can be used even without a tuner because it gives out quite an acceptable SWR already now I have shown this um, uh, on my previous video so this time what I want is um, I'm going to show you how I bring down the SWR on 40 meters um, using my MFJ and my Nano VNA. Okay, so first thing that I will do is I will narrow down the span to uh, say uh, 7.3 something. Okay, so now the span is from 7 to 7.3. Now my target frequency is 7 uh, decimal 100. Yeah, okay, so over there it's a 7100. And uh, the SWR at this frequency is around 1.98 and close to 2, as also shown here on the graph. So what I want is to bring it down some more using, uh, by tuning it with the help of my antenna tuner. So um, first thing I will do is I'm going to switch the selector to the tune side. So my antenna is in coax 1, so I put it there on coax 1. Okay, so when I put it here, you will notice that the SWR went up to infinity, or here it shows around 80. Okay, so because everything here is not yet tuned. So now I'm going to start the tuning process. I will start with the inductor while putting this, uh, the antenna and the transmitter um, knobs on 5, on the middle. Okay, so let me uh, turn this and see if there. Let, let's uh, let's watch this blue line and see if there is any movement as I turn the inductor. So there. Okay. So I think there's slight movement already. Okay. So there you go. So um, now the inductor indicator indicates that it is on H. But still, I have not touched both of this, okay? Um, but it is already within um, the, uh, uh, the span of 7 and 7.3. If I turn it some more, let's see what happens. Okay, so it goes beyond. So, I will go back. Okay, and then from there, I will fine-tune it with the antenna and the transmitter knob. In order to adjust, you have to adjust slowly. Here. As you can see, the dip is already moving to my desired frequency, which is 7.1. Okay, so there you go. It's, it's uh, moving. And you can also see the uh, return loss is also uh, making a dip somewhere there also. Okay, so as I continue to turn, now I have a... Mm, all right okay so there you go i have an swr of 1.01 .01 on 7.102 uh, without adjusting even the uh, transmitter side so it's as easy as that now i get a, a very good swr or the swr i want which is one there might be a slight difference as you connect this to the radio as you um uh uh, use a higher output of about 50 or 100 watts and, but you can just fine-tune it there uh, when you attach the radio 
So there you go. This is uh, tuning the um, uh, off-center fed dipole using the MFJ949E and uh, Nano VNA without using my uh, transceiver. So hope you like it. This is uh, DU7JAY. Stay safe, everyone. Enjoy ham radio. 73. Bye-bye.